Welcome back to another Made in 2 practice. As always, I will give you 5 positions and you have to find the Made in 2 in those positions. So this is the first position. It is what to move Made in 2. You can pause the video if you want to try it. The first move is F7 check. The king has nowhere else to go other than E7 and bishop to g5 is a checkmate. This is the next position. It is white to move and win. What do you think is the mate in 2 in this position? Alright, the first move is the stunning queen takes h7 check. You sacrifice the queen. Black must take it and rook to h5 is a checkmate because the pawn on g6 cannot capture our rook as it is pinned to the king by our bishop. This is the third position. It is white to move and win. You can pause if you want to solve it. So the move is rook to h5 check. The king cannot move so the knight on g3 has to take it and we checkmate black with our g pawn. Going back, the reason why we have to sacrifice our rook is because by forcing the knight to take us, we prevent black from escaping to h5. What I mean is that in this position, if we play g5 check first, black's king can go to h5 because there is no knight there and there is no mate here. Therefore, it was necessary to sacrifice our rook. This is the next position. It is white to move and it is a mate in two. If you want to solve it, you can pause the video. So firstly, we will want to go bishop takes b5 because that is almost checkmate. But black can go knight to d7 and block. So therefore, the first move is queen takes b8 check, giving up the queen. If king to d7, bishop takes b5 is mate. And if rook takes b8, since now we have removed the knight, bishop takes b5 is a checkmate. This is the final position. It is white to play and it is a mate in two. This is a difficult one. What is the winning move for white? The move is the quiet king to b8. This move puts black in Sukzong. Black's only piece that can move is the knight, and whatever move black plays with their knight, it undefends the bishop. However, if knight to c2, you do not take the bishop because the knight can block. Remember, I want you to find a mate in 2 and not a mate in 3. So instead, you will play queen to a8, checkmate. Going back, if the knight moves anywhere else other than c2, you would take the bishop and checkmate black. So that is the end of today's video. If you have any questions, feel free to ask them in the comments and see you guys next time.